aren't you a feisty bunch on Thursday? <laughs> Welcome on in, guys. So yeah, I was um, I was dicking around a little bit with uh, Skyrim Ellie for a little bit last night, probably a little bit, well, most of today. And uh, yeah, <laughs> it's interesting. If anything else, let's get back to Rugal. Oh, and I'll show you some stuff. Some stuff and things. Because <laughs> uh, we're getting kind of close here. We're level 29. Big Head, welcome in. Mr. Me, not you. And we got Lord Pablito. Welcome in. First time before stream, yeah. Gotta go sleep soon. But yeah, sure. Not a problem. Appreciate you uh, stopping in. Ah, oh, it didn't save FOV95. Well, look at that shit, huh? <laughs> so, um... So, yeah, we did some stuff. Uh, I did some self-enchanting. Actually, let me catch you guys up. I still have two perks. Uh, I have no idea what to do with them. I think we were waiting on... Uh, alteration because I'll get a third perk when this hits 75 which is coming up um, I started placing it into enchanting so I have mastery and armor and of course we have soul squeezer for well particularly staves uh, second rank of power stone so they are 35% stronger mana stone which we had the last time, I think. 50% less charge. And it's really for mana shield and staff recharge. Which is 70 and 80, respectively. There's going to be some other stuff. Uh, what else did I do? Mm, nothing in sneak, although sneak is not really important. Uh, one in speech. Still, just the mastery perk. I'm very tempted to start going up the uh, speech, uh, or the shout branch here with uh, tonal harmony. Maybe. I mean, we're only at 38, but to be able to re restore all three stats equal to my cooldown, that's not too, too bad, I guess. That's just going to go up. Um, the only downside to this is when you're... Uh, cooldown is less than uh, what it's supposed to be. That also reduces that. But I mean, it unlocks other things, too. So To make them better, uh, we don't power attack, so it doesn't matter. And uh, yeah, this one's pretty good. You get a quarter of a chance to reduce uh, your shell cooldown immediately. So maybe, maybe, maybe this is the tree we go down. And uh, Illusion is, well, Illusion's going to hit 80, but as you can see, I don't really have anything else. What else is 80? Animage 3. So it'll work on creatures of people up to 40. So this is definitely going to be taken. Uh, I have the first rank of Master in the Mind, so it's half duration. Um, it works on the Undead, Daedra, and Automatons, but, you know, when we hit 100, and we will hit 100 in Illusion, uh, we'll go over 100 probably. Um... I have this set up to where I think the character's uh, skill levels can hit 200. Or maybe 255, I don't know. Um, haven't had too many characters that have done that. so. And of course, Conjuration's still lagging. I actually need to do some training when we go back to the college. Um, we're sort of the Archmage. I know you guys didn't get to see the uh, battle with Ancano. It lasted all of three and a half seconds. Which is uh, why we don't have the Staff of Magnus on us. Um, actually, hold on. Do we have the Staff of Magnus on us? No, it's right here. Uh, because it's pretty OP considering this character is pretty OP. Um, 50 point award when not attacking. I mean... 
Jeez, I should probably keep this with me, but I don't see a point to. So we're not gonna. And then, yeah, the staff of Yurik is still here. Uh, Rugal's got his carry weight sorted down. Um, we do, we, I did place two of the mass, so Croesus and uh, Morakai are placed. And uh, let me check my needs, because we're, we're pretty good. So anyway, um, I made myself an apprentice illusion tome. Uh, this could probably be crafted up better. I'm going to have to check to see. Uh, and some other stuff that we're going to sell. I have another set of Archmage boots and robes. Um, although, I probably have to take this pair out of, off here, so let's let's take all this Archmage stuff. I don't have the item neat, yeah. Because <laughs> the mod interferes with it. It's hysterical. It is absolutely hysterical. Yeah, you get a, you get a full set. You actually get um, the boots, the gloves, the hood, and the robes from Tolfdeer upon completion. Um, and then there's another pair of boots, and there's another pair of robes that you guys already saw inside of the... Uh, Archmage's quarters. I couldn't even think of the word. So let's, um... We don't need them. I'm not going to use them. So let's give him boots. This one doesn't have a hood. Or gloves. The gloves are actually pretty cool. Um, and I was tempted to use them. Just, uh, purely for the magic regen. Because that's all it would really give me, but... Nothing, uh... Nothing else besides that. My magic regen is already good. Karn, welcome in. And rain. Hope you both are doing well. Uh, what else do we have? What else do we have? I'm still on my base stuff. The Iliad Ring of Conjuration. I don't feel the need to really craft anything else. Uh, my basic Black Mage Hood, 20 points. You know. Cloak of uh, Resist Magic, still 10%. I haven't done anything with that. Our backpack is our backpack. Uh, Journeyman Resto. Uh, for like the one restoration spell that I cast, 30%. So I think we're going to swap this out. Uh, we're going to swap that out with something else. I'm going to hold on to the Mage's Circlet for now, because right now it's the best Circlet that I could uh, enchant myself. Uh, it's, or I should say it's better than anything I can enchant myself. Necklace of Health, uh, for reasons, because it's actually not that bad. 30 points, I need it. Still the same robes, uh, but I did make him boots. So my sneaking is now... I had nothing on the boots, mind you. My boots were uh, no enchanted. So I put sneak on this to help. And I did enchant the face mask for destruction. A little bit of cost redux because we need it. And the gloves are still the uh, 40 magica. And I did enchant another left hand ring. Also 40 magica. I think you guys may have seen it. Everything else here. Like Savos' amulet. Don't really need it. Sarthal amulet. Don't really need it. But the rest of the stuff I enchanted. Um, and even this stuff that's unique, sort of, uh, I just self-enchanted to get it up there. We're going to get rid of it. Silver Rogue and Silver Drift. And Shepard. How you guys doing? As Twitch now tells me I went live, like five minutes later. <laughs> oh, so where are we, may you ask? You probably already recognize it. And what time is it? It's, uh, yeah. We don't need any sleep. This is, uh... This is the other home. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm trying to remember what all I have on what. Because playing Ellie, I was doing some different stuff. Alright, so I still only have two. We have to get the Necromancer's Amulet. Blade Curse, Necrosis, Void Bolt, Death Guard. What's six? Frenzy. We have Frenzy now. Eight is Muffle. Or, I'm sorry, seven is Muffle. Eight is what? Calm? Eight's Calm. I have Calm. We're gonna Calm people. You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. <laughs> what say you in your defense? 
Welcome in, Wind. Well, Smith giving a shout out to you. And I'm gonna I'm gonna verbally shout out Karn, although I'm not gonna shout it. Um, his YouTube or his YouTube is on my uh, about page, guys. For those of you that don't know, and I believe he just put out a. I didn't actually get to watch the vid, Karn. So is it um. <laughs> Let it, uh, that's like if that gets stuck in it's gonna be stuck in my head. <laughs> Who am I kidding? <laughs> is it a dumb one? Too late. Yeah, yeah, it'll be stuck in my head. <laughs> stuck in my head. I was all by myself. No one was looking. I was thinking. Never mind. All right, let's get going. We're level 29. Um, I did note that um, I wanted to put the staves here. They just don't like to stay here. They like to float right here where my death guard was. Apparently. <laughs> and now zombie's gonna be stuck in my head. So yeah. Uh mistrust. We could probably sell to uh I forget the guy's name. Dramora. Mr. Dramora here. There's something you need. Rake. Yeah. Yes, Sarah. I can hardly wait. He sounds so enthused. <laughs> because we don't need this staff of pain. And he's got 4,000 gold and I want money. I guess I'll keep the stall room dagger. Uh, I ditched my pickaxe. Because why? Uh, gems are a dime a dozen. And I don't really need ore. And I could pretty much buy whatever. So, um... Don't need this. Don't need this. I'm going to keep the unique cloaks for now. The stuff that I self-enchanted. Ooh, there we go. We'll keep Savos and Sarthal and yada, yada, yada. Oh, we almost tapped him out. And uh, we're, we're going to definitely hold on to some of these healing potions. Probably the stamina ones, too. What else do we have from? Oh, dragon bones. Yeah, I got those from uh, Labyrinthine. Don't need them. They have a bunch of Nordic pot. We're like, why? Why? See, now we're we're getting down close. I like to be around that 200 mark when I'm up here. Uh, sure, sure. There we go. Naked snake. <laughs> Welcome in. Are we buying anything from this douche? Let's see. Blood boil. Concentrate to summon whirling blood that harms foes within 26 feet and the caster. No, thank you. Sounds cool, but no, thank you. Although I am tempted to buy it out of sheer uh, curiosity as to what it looks like, because uh, I don't think I've ever used this. How long does it last for? Oh, it's a concentration. Oh, so it doesn't matter. All right, well. 44 Magicka per se. I mean, that's like... So they'd have to have straight-up magic resist to even do anything with that. And Horrid Wilting um, is just OP. It just is, so I'm not going to take it. All, all my spells and stuff like that right now are OP. Now, if you'll excuse me. Oh, okay. Well, you're excused. So yeah, we're, um, we're in the reach. Because reasons.
I wasn't gonna stream. I was actually gonna, cause I'm looking at the weather and it's like, we're we're due for more rain. Like today was a, a crappy day. It was 70 degrees all day, which to me is too cold. I don't like I don't like 70 degrees. I like warm. 80 plus Fahrenheit. Uh oh. That's a that's a hunter or a peddler. I don't know who that is. Oh no, those are Forsworn. Oh, those are bandits. They're fighting somebody. Yeah, you're dead. Dead, dead, dead. They killed the horse. And... Yeah, they killed the peddler. Where were you? Didn't bother to help. So what all are we taking from this guy? Normally I'd be, you know, eating up all these alchemy ingredients, but uh, we'll, well, we'll take the arrows because they don't weigh anything and we can sell them. And uh, let's feed because I don't remember the last time I fed. Probably right, uh, right before. It's in the 80s where you're at, Wind. Uh, a little jealous. It's going to get up there, um, just not today, and not tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be 77, which to me is still too cold. Ooh, elven arrows. And we'll extract some blood from them. So yeah, we're in the reach. Uh, I'm only here to find uh, Tirishan and Mistrust. It was the only reason why I came here. Oh, he has nothing. Okay. So, um, there's the swimming pond. I did come up here by myself. Uh, there should be another dragon mound. Or, well, here, let's look at my journal. Speak to the Greybeards. We have to do that. We'll be doing something else probably before we do that anyway. Inspect your new property. Yeah, I, I, I did this. What I'd like to do is I'd like to go to, uh, <laughs> I'd like to go to, uh, here, let's, uh, put a marker there. I want to go to Windhelm, damn it. I want the Necromancer's Amulet. The game is, uh, not being very kind to me when it comes to that. What's up, little fox? Out of the way. I think we've been in and out of the city multiple times. And, uh, blood on the ice just will, it refuses to, uh, hey, what's up here? There's the, there's, alright, there's a dragon over there, too. Yeah, blood on the ice refuses to, uh, start up. Hey, you know what? Screw it. I have a plan. Let's stick to the plan. My death guards even with me? They're slow. There's, I mean, you know, what can you do? 77 is our summer weather. I, uh, if that's the warmest it gets, I feel for you. Because, um, see, you know, when it's normally summer here, it's nice and hot and humid. The, the humidity especially, that's that's what I like. Did you get them all? Good job, guys. I could take that and sell it. Did I just say in Scarum, I now have a husky living in my manor. Doge. Let's extract blood. 
Do you have a servant? I hope you have a servant in there that sweeps up the uh, the husky hairs. <clears throat> Every manor needs servants. <laughs> Alright, Lord Pebbleedle. Much appreciated. Thank you for stopping in. And I'm getting that hydrate in now, actually, for you. Because, uh, yeah. Also, guys, I, um, I committed heresy. I switched to tea. And I'll probably be switching to tea for, uh, the foreseeable future. Um,. Yeah, I was drinking way too much coffee. I and mean, I normally drink decaf. Which is, uh... I thought that was a bear. I'm looking at those bushes. Yeah, which is kind of hysterical on its own. Um, and I realized... Pretty much ever since, uh... The pandemic... Um, I was drinking about... A pot to a pot and a half of coffee a day. Decaf or otherwise. Normally it's uh, it's half-calf or decaf. So I switched to tea today and I feel a hell of a lot better. Already. With honey, of course. Uh, black tea, honey, and milk. That's how I take my teas. If I drink hot green tea, it's just green tea with honey, and that's it. Although I did say, did somebody put no fast travel in there and I just missed it? Hold on, let me go back and check. I'm not sure. I just saw the hydrate. Okay, good. Because I, I, I want to get to, uh, I want to get to Windhelm. We have we have business in Windhelm. Important business. That is too much. I know, right? Damn it. Oh, because, yeah, just take the regular carriage. <laughs> so for those of you joining, um, that are maybe first time with this play uh i have i need frostfall campfire everything's active Ooh, excuse me because i have soda now uh what do i have just plain old cherry coke extra cocaine <laughs> yeah green tea is nice um i do like cold green teas i prefer hot hot like hot brewed green tea traveling in the reach is dangerous that is you that is my favorite carriage. or a good chai tea Preferably raspberry. Where do you want to go? Uh, take me to Windhelm, good sir. Climb and back, and we'll be off. That's right. Yeah, we will be off. You ever met one of them cats? Khajiit, I think they called themselves. I think that's what it is. Yeah, the, the tea leaves. Full of them down south. Did you say I drink black tea with honey and milk? No, 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 yeah, uh, it's the tea leaves, so, yeah, the black tea, it's black tea leaves. Um, just whatever honey I can get, that's about as natural as can be. No, just, you know, no added preservatives to it. Because um, honey already has natural sugars in it anyway, it's, which is why I don't put any sugar in it. Um, and uh 2% milk. I like the uh I like whole milk probably the best. Um it's just not good to have in large quantities. Plus uh milk and me don't really get along as it is. So there's that. Leave that to your imagination. How's that pronounced? Is that uh is it, is it pronounced maca? Your skin's as pale as the snow. Karn said the same thing too, yeah. You're, You're all about that. So let's um let's head on in. I wanna see if she's still alive. Welcome. 
let me know if you want anything. I think I've got a clean mug around here. Somewhere. Somewhere. Need something? Don't like those eyes you got. There's a bad We got that. Is that, uh, what's his name? Stenvar, right? With the witch plate? Yeah. Um, Adonado? Captain, have you heard? She's usually up here serving dragons? people. This is Voldsu. Uh, you know better than to believe every idiot traveler that wanders through. But she looks pretty good. Like I said, the it's not the most glorious uh, NPC overhaul, but it's only one, so that's all that really matters. Hey, Rolf. And she doesn't have a bed in here, so maybe, hopefully, she's dead. Ooh. Yeah, you do that while I snag a dream. From I don't know who this is. Nils. He must be the cook up in Candlehearth Hall. Or so I've heard. Okay, she's not here. I don't know if she wanders, but let's hope she's dead. It's like the worst thing I could possibly say, but yeah, let's hope she's dead. What is over here? I don't think I've been in this one yet, have I? Yeah, you hear somebody yelling. Oh yeah! Oh, I gotta save here. Finally! <laughs> Finally she's dead. Guard! I am more than happy to help you guys in whatever's going on here. I had nothing to do with it. But my services are available. <laughs> I've been waiting like... I know, this is what, the third stream we're level 30? Or close to it, 29? Shit, I, I like... She should have been dead in the first stream. I want that damn amulet. Another girl killed. <laughs> Hopefully she's this dead. Ah, I did it twice. From Hall. It's doing that weird thing, Gwen. It did it in yours nice too, where like I would but I can't use a quote, but it would add, like it would look like it added it twice, or it would say the same quote twice. I don't know. Something twitchy is going on with Twitch. Don't add that. That's just that randomly just came out of me. Two things. Um, how was she killed? Same as the others. Looks like she was stabbed and then cut apart. It's like an animal got to her. But these are the wounds of a blade. Oh, because you did... Yeah, it's gotta be... Oh, okay, never mind. I'm an idiot. I didn't see you had the space between add and quote the first one. And now looking at it more carefully, I've observed that you did it right the second time. So congratulations. You get a golf clap. <laughs> Another, so this has happened before. Susanna's the third. Third, it's always huh? the same. Young girl killed at night, body torn up. Sounds like the guards aren't doing their damn job. Look, there's a war going on, if you hadn't heard. I hadn't heard. We barely have enough no, you're the first to guard to tell me this. Much less patrol every corner. Uh, like I said, when I walked over here I can offer some services looks like you can use some help right if you want to help ask some of these gawkers if they saw anything useful all right I can I'm do going that. to examine the body before the rat no you're not you're just gonna stand there you really gonna examine the body I don't think so you're gonna stand there looking like a guard I have no problem with orcs, but that stronghold they've got in the southeast Norselburg, it's an affront to my people okay Thank you for marking that location. Hey, Gawker, you're all bloody. This is a shame. Did you see what happened here? Uh, no, sorry. But I did notice that her coin purse was still intact, so whoever did this wasn't after gold. She has a coin purse. I'm going to keep preparing the body, if you'll excuse me. Can I me. check? All right, you go prepare the body. I'm going to look for a coin purse, because I'm not so sure. Put that down. Oh, Sorry. Still didn't see a coin purse. Uh, what about you, Gawker? Always sad when someone has to die. Ah. Hitting the, uh, skooma, I see, huh? Do you see what happened here? Sorry. I thought I saw a fellow running away, but didn't get a good look at him. Ah. Well, that helps. A fellow. And you're not a Another fellow. One. You're a lass. Terrible. 
Oh, that's right, Silda. Yeah, we've we've run into a chair. Have a gold piece. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Divines bless your kind heart. Yeah, yeah. Do you see what happened here? I heard a scream and came running, but she was already like this. Did you examine her coin purse? Here. Okay. That body is torn up. Oh, oh, just take that. No, no, no. Oh, she's got some goat cheese. Let's see if Helgard yells at me again. Look at the Hello, depth of the cuts Hello, and everything compared to vanilla. Jeez. Let's flip her over and see. Whoa. God, it's it's so good to see you again. Yeah. I'm trying. I'm trying to. Yeah, we, I want to show everybody how effed up she is. If you've got some time, stop by my house of curiosities. I promise you will oh, wonder. I guess that's the best we can get. Could we pick her up normally? No, it don't work either. Keep your hands to yourself. I'm not gonna steal her. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. Look at that. For those of you that love the the gory side. Oh, and a neck seam. I guess because she's dead. Alright. Enough of the shenanigans. It's honest work, if a bit I mostly deal with petty thievery and drunken brawls. Been too long since we've had a good bandit raid. Well, I've spoken to your witnesses. Just like always, nobody saw anything useful. The bastards escaped again. Okay, so like I said, I offer my services. So, you guys gonna let me help or what? Look, friend, if you think I'm you not can your do friend, guy. The Legion of Guards, be my guest. You'll need to talk to the steward, though. We can't just let anyone go around claiming to be an official business. Okay. If he's steward. willing, got it. Then we'll talk. All right, all right. There we go. <laughs> go talk to your relief. Bam! Blood on the ice. Raise up strong, noble things, and lay low false yards and the cowards who hide behind them. Hello, hello, hello. Interested in fighting in the pit? No. The rules are strict, but if I don't see it, it didn't happen. All know friend? What I mean? Think you might be in the wrong place, friend. Yeah, you're right. People are rightly stirred up about the damn I mean, I have a house right over there, but sure. <laughs> Alright, let's go see if uh, the good Sir Yorleaf is actually awake. He should be. The hell? We've intercepted couriers from solitude. The Empire is putting a great deal I'm of I'm not much of a strategist, but Lord Ulfric listens to my counsel all the same. If you have any news of the Western Hordes, take it to Ulfric immediately. Your relief. Uh, I'm actually here about these murders. These are difficult times indeed, when men stalk their brethren like beasts. My men are stretched thin as it is. If you offer your aid, I gladly accept. The guards will be told to assist you as necessary. Good, Happy good. to lend a hand as much as I can as well. All right, that works for me too. So, I still say you should take them all out like you did Dead King Torrig. Yeah. Torrig was merely a message to the other yards. Whoever we replace them with will need the support of our army. Does look pretty good. Things hinge on. I like the uh, uh, additional fire pits the city all around here as well. Heat is faint, but steady. Can we run through this? Yeah, did you ever notice that? So the uh, Eastgrimoire statue, apparently, from I long to be out there. Uh, right from the creation the kit. I'm assuming this is a CK error. I have not found an Eastgrimoire statue in any mod that I've ever used that I cannot clip through entirely. See that? I mean, of course you saw it, but... Could you believe it? You could just hide right here. I'm beginning to warm. Oh, no. 
I don't want to warm up that way. Let's read the inscription. The first harbinger, the first man, the bringer of words. Skyrim belongs to the north. Okay. And they're just they're just shouting Talos stuff. For the uh, sons of Skyrim. Yep. So yeah, there's the blood. I did notice with this overhaul, um, you know, it, it obviously doesn't take this quest into account, but to me it's not really an issue. Um, we know where the blood leads, although there's, I thought there was supposed to be more here, but it's pretty obvious where it's going. Now who's this? This is just a laborer, huh? Ah, don't do that. No one's gonna know. Although somebody saw me. Can we break in to hear him? Let's try. Damn it, I had uh, 69 picks to start. I was hoping to keep it at that number. A little more? Oh, the other way. Fine. There was it here. No. Fuck. <sighs> it's going to be one of these days, isn't it? There we go. Also, uh, let me check something real quick. While, while we have access, I'm going to make a save. Uh, I'm going to all tab out real quick. Oh, okay. I was just curious because I thought the chat might have uh, gotten stuck. You guys are watching intently. From the marks on the floor, it looks like this box was pushed against the wall recently. I mean, it's not really against the wall, but sure. Aha! The journal! And I, I, I don't... I don't need... God knows how many of them. Eleven. I am Mr. Me, not you. Cheering a hundred bits, throwing them my way. Much appreciated. Thank you, thank you. Uh, but where the butcher? Killer who haunts the streets of Windhelm. These calamitous times bring out the worst in people. Don't become the next victim. See Viola Giordano if you spot any suspicious behavior. I've been waiting to spot suspicious behavior for freaking ever. The plans are coming together swimmingly. I've found good sources of bone, flesh, and blood, but thus far, a good sampling of sinew and marrow have escaped me. Nah, no matter. The city is swollen with contemptuous fools who will be missed by nobody. Last night, I was almost able to corner Susanna as she left Candlehearth. The idiot guard showed up just at the wrong moment, and I had to turn about. Just out for a stroll and so forth. There will be other chances, but the time is drawing near. I think back to my time in Winterhold, all the wasted minds up in their towers. They only explore the magic they already know. I am discovering new magic here, something deeper than cantrip shenanigans of fire and light. This flesh magic is older than us, perhaps older than the world itself. I am tugging at the corners of the fabric of the universe, and where it bunches and folds is where I shall create my greatest triumph. One more attempt at the candle hearth girl. She's proving to be a bit too cautious, but those strong joints of hers should contain the most exquisite tendons. Worth the effort. Tonight. As if you're not the source of suspicious behavior. I am not. 
I know no such things. From the dust, these look left over from when the previous occupant moved out. Okay. Now, I came in here one time and there was a like a a rune that was invisible on the wall and I got blasted by it. These haven't been used for ages. Nothing but skeever droppings and cobwebs inside. Okay. Wind. 500 biddies making it rain. The wind making it rain. That's, uh, we got a nature theme going on here. Shelf is filled with more of those butcher flyers from around the city. One pile looks misshapen. Ah. An unusual amulet. Strange. Is it not? Mr. Me, not you. 200 more biddies. Much appreciated. I'm, uh... I'm gonna get that... That amulet. And then shenanigans are really gonna start flying. Perfectly good wardrobe is left behind for some reason, huh? What's inside? Let's see. Perfectly good. Noble gilded wrist guards. Eh. Boots. Boots. Eh. What about this one? Seems to be nailed to the wall for some reason. Okay. You, you can see. Can you, can you see? You can see inside there. Look at that. I don't know if the base game or some other replacers do that. You could see light coming from inside there. Unless it's me and I just missed it. It's like completely obvious here. Oh, so all right. So this is so this is 3D uh this is coming from 3D furniture which is part of a larger collection by Mathy. Uh which is just meshes and texture replacers. But yeah, look at that. You, Cuz you don't you normally the the back panel um is hooked, but I believe this Yeah, look at that. That looks so much better. Such a simple mod. Oh, I mean what a horrible sight. A wooden plate, tankard. Lights flickering on and off. Thank you, Skyrim. And a journal. The altar is built to some unknown magic. It looks like someone is using body parts towards some gruesome end. Aha! Another journal. Let's take this one. Let's uh, get out of here and read. As to, uh, you know, not a, not a upset the uh, feng shui going on in the room there. Seventeen tendons and assorted ligaments. A hundred and seventy-three fragments for, of bone for assemblage. Approximately four buckets. Uh, bucketfuls. Weird how that reads. Of blood. Nord preferred racist blood. Six spoons of marrow. No more than two from a thigh. Twelve yards of flesh before cutting. Star scrying to the edge of the ice mind. Look to the lights. Where the souls dance, revealing the time when a spark will revive, when the rotted unites under the most skillful hands. Translation from Aldmer text, as interpreted by the Iliads, and the first and first transcribed by Altmer. Provenance and authority unknown. Soon. Well then. Oh, this is uh, this is Se Win. This is still my same. My same play. This is Rugal. I was just I was dicking around on Ellie um, with Perkis, mainly for testing reasons because of the uh, Perkis add-on for special edition that I have for the patcher itself. Okay, nothing in there. Nothing in there. The chair is stacked on the bed in an odd fashion. 
Anytime I see a chair stacked on the bed in an odd fashion, I wonder what the proper fashion for stacking a chair on a bed would be. And then I want to bitch slap the person that does it. We'll take that. Okay, F5. Because I don't feel like rereading shit. That's GTFO. So who do we got to talk to now? We got your leaf. We actually have to do two things. We have to find Viola, who may not be up yet. I could break into her home and capture her dream and then hope we can calm her and talk to her. Maybe I could use seduction. Although I don't think I have the power for it yet. Let me see. I do. Oh, this is, this is, this is glorious. Uh, you guys, nah, don't, don't even worry about the hype train with me. Save it for a more, uh, a more talented, uh, streamer. But I do appreciate it, though. We are going to talk to Viola, but first I want to, I want to go see if I can, I, I, this is, this is a stupid amulet. I have no need for this, so let's get rid of it. We're going to get rid of it. We're going to go find that, that man, he has a, a curious shop or some, something like that. Bread and salt. Yeah, we were in there before. And, uh, yeah, since my stamina has a bitch of a time regening in the daytime, we'll just use long stride. Why not, right? I have a ton of magicka, so. And he's open. Perfect. And can a partridge and a pear. Yeah, you can. Did what? Well, actually, out of curiosity, wind. Um. Did something about it make it look like it was Ellie? I am curious. I, I haven't done anything. Like I said, this is just one uh, texture. One texture pack. Skyland AIO. We got some stuff for the interiors. Some Mathies. Mathies stuff. You know, some bits My and bobs. My and I once traveled the world to assemble our collection. Oh, he looks Something good. Look at the clothes he's got on. Those clothes are actually pretty snazzy. I don't care much for the war. I mean, they're not high res or nothing like that. That's common clothes. Actually, I, I really recommend, if you're going to run the common clothes and armors mod, upscale the textures. Because this is the mod as it sits. They are very, very low quality, in my opinion. Some parts look better than others, but like here. Now, I haven't done it myself. Um, I probably will. Uh... Because they are distributed out through the level lists. So I, I would actually recommend upscaling the clothes to like around 4K if you can. Cathedral Assets will help you with this. Uh, do you know anything about this amulet? Let me see. Yes. Ah, uh, yes. This is the Wheelstone. The it's Wheelstone. It's an heirloom symbol of the power of Windhelm. Traditionally, it's carried by the court mage. I would uh, be interested in acquiring it. If you're willing to part <clears throat> with it, that is. For a piece like that, I could pay... I mean, he's really gold. hitting the skooma. So much so that he's got... He's drinking invisible cups... Or drinking out of invisible cups in his hand. Uh, You don't think the court maid should have it, then, if it belongs to him? Wound for? Bah. It's purely ceremonial. That got your attention. No use for it. Besides, All right, Rain. I wouldn't want to be the one to give it to him. Better run around getting everything plugged in and charging. Storm coming. Stay safe. Yeah, we will. It's weird here, right? So, um, it's still sunny. Like, it's really sunny out. But I'm looking at, like, the skyline where, like, the trees and, you know, and it's pitch black. And that's, like, dead south of us. So. All right, sir, you have a deal. Wonderful. This will be a splendid addition to my private collection. Okay. Strange amulet lost. I just have to read it. We'll be back. I think. Maybe. I don't know. Will we be back? Who knows? F5. So, yeah, in my, um... Little bit of experimenting with uh, 
You should unload some of that unwanted gear. Head over to Sodri's used wares. Talk to the elf. I'll do that. So now we gotta go find Viola. Because Viola is the one that updates the quest. My friend died. Things won't be the same without her. Uh, you were friends with Santa, huh? Stole your dreams. Free to the younger. Staring at the wall. Eyes open. Danger could be anywhere. Uh, we don't need any work. All right then. All right, you can go back to. Uh, I guess what would you call it? Um, paying respects to the honored dead. There's yeah, Isgrimor, Ingol, Ilgar, Valder. These are all the companions, I believe, throughout the city with this mod. I, it should give you 500. Because there's another wall or two. Of course, I may be entirely wrong about that. Feel free to flame me if I am. What do you need? Uh, I will promptly ignore it. Um, we need to find this lady. Guards can't help. Let's see if we can break into her home. Ta da another master lock. Let's watch Magus Break Picks, Episode 3. Fucking hell. It's a master. I only need to go a little bit from where the pick started. I'm doing it wrong. There we go. Now watch her be awake and... Kick me out immediately. Stupid picks deserve their fate. Yes. Yes, they do. Uh, so this is... She's probably sleeping. If she's not sleeping, she's about town, so... Ooh, there we go. Hold on. 80 means something. So let's see what my s illusion spells do. My basic calm is 43. I don't even have... Um, pacify yet but frenzy like fury is 39 frenzy's 51 and i dual cast these so keep that in mind um what does it do for muffle so a single muffle cast is 356 seconds um what's a dual cast 12 minutes Almost 15 freaking minutes. I remember... I, I, I must have been using Ordinator. And... Uh, I think Illusion was pretty much maxed for me. But I remember a dual cast muffle... Uh, was lasting... Actually, this might be longer. I'm not sure. But damn. Okay. Just in case she's awake. Oh, she's, she's not here. Hmm. That's empty. Hey, you know what? Let's take that end out of our okay? We'll rob her blind while we're here. So she's out and about walking. Can enchant that. Yeah, I love um I love three D furniture. I know it's uh it's probably not the most popular right now. Uh for you know well for furniture. Um but I feel like no matter how you're running your game, um you can add this mod in, and it really makes things look nice and clean. 
Now, if Matthew could clean up his 3D tree mod, I would be happy. She's not sitting there. But the furniture looks fucking amazing. Alright. Let's go find Viola. Ever since that Imperial Craven ran me through from behind, I've had trouble breathing. Yeah, yeah? Oh, thank you. Divines bless your kind heart. Hey, see ya. What the? Keep your damn magic to yourself. Yep, I'll do that. Keep it to myself. So she could be anywhere. I'm gonna look in the normal places. So Silda's up here. Sometimes she's hanging around the great, or she's coming from the great quarter. So let's go look there. Wow, you could see it flicker, and that's weird. There's, uh, there's Sophie. My shitty home that I bought for... Is covered in ash. Red Mountain makes sure of that. It does. Yeah, the home that I paid a thousand septums for is there. Which is literally just a bed. Where else is she? Does she go in? She doesn't go into the corner club, does she? Sadri's is open. Let's see if we can find her. I don't know where she's at. There's the temple. up kid let's see if we can find her from up here it is bright I hope I don't have my, my no I don't even have my vision on all right let's go check uh go check the end check around here too who's this is this her yeah be on the lookout the butcher could be around Got the her. corner uh this is reshade wind this is just reshade yep same same setup same setup i haven't changed anything with it what can you tell me about this butcher i've been following him for months now well not actually following trying to find him the guards won't help. The people won't help. I'm the only one who thinks he can be caught. Why can't the guards help? They say they're too busy with a war. I say, what good is winning a war if we're still terrorized by one of our own? Hmm. Well, what about the people? Uh, the rest of the people don't care either? Is that is that the theme here, or what? Oh, they care, all right. Just none of them thinks to do anything about it. They say I'm just snooping around bothering people. But I'm trying to save lives. All right, well, listen, I found the journal in the killer's lair. Two of them, actually, but here, you can huh? have at it. What's it say? Well, it sounds like a necromancer has been experimenting. Not that I know anything about that. There have been rumors swirling about him for years. As long as I can remember. Wound but he's huh? a dangerous man. That's why they call him the Unliving. I wouldn't approach him directly. But he sounds just like the kind this of person I would approach directly. Needs to go straight to the steward. He'll listen to you. Uh, I don't know about that. Steward doesn't really seem like he was the listening type. I guess I was wrong. I thought there was another wall here, but, uh... Nope. Not so. Ulgrim won't give us a straight answer. He's a true lord. He'll come around. Go. Yeah, the only issue that I have with it, Wind, is the uh, eye adaptation can sometimes look... Like here, if I turn my light off, right? So it, it's really whatever you're looking at. at the new Nissus Corner Club. It seems like it lightens up. Call it a tavern is beyond me. Though when you look away, like if you're looking at the corner, and then as you pan uh, over to it, it gets uh, oh, 
am wizard. Keep your it gets a little bit brighter. Wakey, wakey. Whatever you've heard I can do is probably true. Yeah, so just for to show you like an example between common clothes and uh, like the mage robes from uh, the combination of uh, weapons, armor, clothing, clutter, fixes, and armor, clothing, extension. I have the higher res add-ons uh, strictly because I wasn't going to be using an EMB. So you can, you can tell in like the embroidery here that it's a little bit better. Now the hood is an LE mod by Lind, which I did manage to upscale slightly, but you can see the difference in quality, right? So I, uh, I hear you dabble in necromancy. I beg your pardon? Necromancy. Uh, it's Da Vinci. One. I am a member it's the same one that EJ is using. Winterhold, in good standing. They haven't allowed. Me oh, and if you're, I, I saw the question about you asking about the reshade errors, like when you load into your game. So, those, they're, they're normal. They're not going to affect anything. Um, they're not going to affect your play. Uh, because Da Vinci has it too. And if you notice in EJ's video, she's, she's got the error. In her in hers she never mentions it and I honestly don't know if she even knows that it's there uh, but I did some looking into it and uh, it doesn't affect anything because they're gonna use uh, what they're designed to use now some of them like you saw I think what was it like uh, was it called Technicolor one and two you had to turn them off otherwise the game looked really really fucked up uh, but some of them most of them don't most of them just use uh, what they're designed to use, and they just have everything else disabled. Now, you can enable other stuff if you want to get a certain look, which is what she's alluding to when she says, you know, make a separate um, uh, reshade profile to tinker with. Like, she named hers Da Vinci Tinkering. Right? But I didn't really need to. I just tinkered on the main one. Because I, feel, I figured if I messed up anything, I could just reset the whole thing. It's a lot easier than uh, tweaking an E&B. Romancy for hundreds of years. <clears throat> it's the version of re, uh, reshade. No, always it's it's like E and B always use the newest. Like E and B, you always want to use the newest binaries. Uh, same with reshade, whatever the newest reshade is. Like I think what's it five dot one dot two, or five dot two dot one, one of those two, five something. My what now? I've never kept a journal, I can assure you. It's a matter of uh, getting when the right exactly settings. That's all it is. Look like. The amulet is uh, eight-sided, jade, ringed with ebony, and a worn carving. I know it well, or at least I've heard of it. I would wager that carving once depicted a skull. That is the necromancer's amulet of legend. It appears you were at least half right. There is necromancy at the heart of this. I knew it. So I guess uh, Calixto is wrong then. Yeah. Calixto and his books are often confused. Don't about you dare matters. knock books. It happens to the best of us. All right, so what can we do now? I've been noting a pattern to when the killings happen. Now that we know they're tied in to some sort of necromantic ritual... I think I know when the next might occur. Let's see. From a Lordus of last sea. It's amazing he uh, figures all this out now. It will happen soon. Very soon. Keep watch in the stone quarter tomorrow night. That's almost certainly where the killer will strike next. Yeah, the stone quarter at night. Okay. Well, we have a home here. Uh, do we have anything to disenchant? Uh, aside from... I, I can't believe I haven't found another resist magic. What do we got here? Sneak, right? Yeah, we're not going to need these necklaces. Pretty soon. 
Amulet of Vermina. That actually looks pretty cool, but... Let's throw some sneak on that. I'll hold on to everything else. Okay. Drop a save bomb here. Ooh, he's got some. Ah, damn wizard. Keep your spells off of me. I'll try. Saw nothing. What do you need? Soon. Very scientific answer. Yes. Whoa. Need something? <clears throat> I was really, really tempted Let to um, to add Balroon in here for a uh, town-specific home. Uh, I just wasn't sure how it was going to conflict. Uh, so, you know, I, di I didn't bother to test it to see, but let's go take a look. We'll see where it adds it in. I don't think it would have. So, for those of you unfamiliar with the... Ball, uh, ball rune is added right here. So, let's just take a look. So, this is Windhelm SSE. It probably would have needed a patch. Because this is all base Skyrim. But right here is the overhaul. Although if it... Since it's, a, it's really a doorway with an interior cell, it might not. You, you may just have to remove some of these edits. But I believe they get removed anyway. So, um, so let's go up the ladder. And uh, this is my thousand septum graystone lodge. Where do you see how lodgy it is? It's amazing. We got a cook pot, some empty barrels, some uh, firewood, a shelf, some pots and pans, little table, a wardrobe. Is there anything in here? No. And a chest. And that's it for a thousand septums. But let's let's lay down. Now with the go to bed mod, if you initiate it in third person, um, you tend not to glitch as much. I've noticed. If you start to do the go to bed motion in first person, it can glitch. Now there is still a chance he may get up on the uh, left side of the bed, like the wall side, but we'll see. So it's going to happen at night, right? So we want to we want to be ready for this. 9:45. All right. He should get up like normal. Also, if you do it in first person, the chance they're going to flip-flop and uh he'll be laying uh with his feet on the pillows, so to speak. <laughs> nice chest. I like it too. Whoa. Please, leave me be. I don't want any trouble. Okay, I won't give you trouble. I can already see. One of us. One of us. Skeletons are all the way over there. Can we calm him, is the question. Do we want to calm him? We may have to wait. Oh, there they come. Yes. Let's get over here. You guys, uh, come here. Stand over here. All right, we're going to hang out here for another hour. Yeah, there she is. 
And I believe that's Calixto right there. So yeah, let me let me instead of doing this, let me get my dagger. I haven't used it yet, but let's um poison with frostbite venom. That's a way to die. Flop. Hey, I'm able to Zenithar. Awesome. Flawless. Deft hands. I don't have that. There we go. Finally. <sighs> Magic by 80. Summon to reanimated undead deal 50% attack damage and regenerate health. Increased undead Summon limit by one, and my health and stamina regenerate 75% slower. Yes, so this is going to take the place of my... Oh, he had a bunch of stuff that I don't have. Let's see if it shows. I don't think it's going to show on lens, for whatever reason. Maybe without the hood. Yeah, it does. We may have to find the new hood. Yeah, it covers it right up. F to the five, but you know what this means. One, two, three of them. And that's also going to increase my health by another 100, so instead of 438, we're at 538. Beautiful. Conjuration is almost at 50, which is good. What does that get me? Nothing. Doesn't get me nothing. We don't raise anything. That may be the furthest we go in there. I do like having three. Oh, you know what? We didn't. Uh, we didn't feed on him, did we? Let's go visit his house. Only seventy-seven feedings. And I don't have much in the way of restoration, honestly. So, like, no respite perk, anything like that. So I'm going to have to be very, very uh, careful with my stamina. Health isn't really a problem. All right. Let's take that. We don't need that. Giant's toe. Anything else? Ysgrimoire's soup spoon. Dancer's pipe. No, thank you. Uh, sure. Does he have anything else in here? Not really. Well, let's read his... Uh, I believe that'll try and get me to fall nocturnal. We haven't prayed either, so let's... I think we may have to do this outside. Oh, no. Yeah, favor with Manny Marco goes up to 90... 90.6%. Awesome. Death guard out of the way. Soon enough, my sweet Lucilla, you'll be with me again. Normally when such words are written, it is because the love left behind is soon to depart. But in my case, I hope to soon bring your spirit back into my world. For it was you who loved this world so much, not I. 
I continue to collect your new form from the ragged bits around Windhelm. But they only knew what destiny would soon grace their bodies with your spirit imbuing them with higher purpose. They would surely thank me for the great gift I gave them. I reserve for them a place of beauty alongside your heart. The day draws near. Soon I will hold you, and I will show you this, and it will be as delivering a long-forgotten letter to a weary traveler. Love always, Calixto. Well, F5, just cause. Let's go talk to uh, your relief, complete this, and then let's GTFO of Windhelm. It's going to be weird not being a vampire pretty soon. I probably should say this too, Wind. Um, if you were curious about this one that EJ has, I did try it with Lux, and it didn't look as good as ELFX with Shadows. Now, Lux with EMB looks a little bit better, although you, get, you know how many patches there are for that. Um, ELFX Shadows does have a patch hub, um, but it's not nearly as extensive. And uh, I think if you're if you're running a, an ENB, it... Uh, it's probably still the better of the two options. Of whatever course, if you you're, you know, do, if you're following the list, then you're pretty much locked into whatever they do. So, uh, you already know all that I know. Oh yeah, we didn't even need it to come talk Strength to you. Strength and steel are well and good, but magic. You really is should be. Power in this world. He, he should be sleeping in one of these, right? Need something? No, he's down. Is he downstairs? Double? He's downstairs. Out of the way. He's usually in bed. Okay. I know why he's not in bed. I don't have immersive citizens. And let them die with their false king. His bed's over. Oh no, his bed's over here. Time. We know the price of freedom. But people are still weighing things in their hearts. What's left of Skyrim to weigh this? Yeah, it changed up where his uh What the? Keep your damn magic to yourself. I am. Yes. Wake up. Any luck finding the butcher? Well, put some clothes on and I'll tell ya. There you go. Feel better now? Good, good. So it wound up being Calixto. Uh, he was the butcher. Ismir's beard. The man was always a bit odd, but I wouldn't have expected it. So you can see common clothes. Again, I believe you'll find the. I like the mod. I like that it adds different clothing, and I just don't think it's really well made. I do use it though. I do use, and I use it often. Uh, you know, just prepare to look at some unsightly things with it. Okay, go back to sleep. Travel safely. Great harbingers, huh? Book of the Dragonborn. I fight because you know what it tell us. Your Songs of Skyrim. What we all feel That's why you will so you can see, yeah, uh, rallies, documents. But the day words are enough. Would be the day when soldiers like us. That's interesting. Well, who else is up here? I will gladly retire from the world. Where such a day comes. Aye. But in the meantime, we have a war to plan. Alright, let's, uh, let's get down here. This is what, the kitchens? This way. Oh, we don't want to go into the cellar. Nope, 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 we don't. Cool. 12.46, eh?
things. Gotta love the crows mod. Let's go down here. I don't think I've been down this side yet, have I? Wall side in. Dock master's home, huh? Let's break in. I probably should have left my uh, skeletons outside, but as long as I'm quiet. There's Harold. Get Signy right in the butt. Mm. Ah, damn wizard. Keep your spells off of me. Yeah, you saw nothing. Nice map, look at that. Steel shipping map. I don't know if that's fur something, but, you know. Soon, very scientific answer. Oh, that was from before. Okay. My bad. <laughs> As I'm reading it, I'm like, oh. Yeah, and it, here's a side you never really... Yeah, well, because there's a, a giant wall here. You can never get here. Here's the hist. Dock work is not good work. Better than Black Marsh, though. Much better. Yeah? Mm hmm. What's this? Boarded up? Nope. Accepts no alms. I don't like strangers. So how much do you make as a dock worker? That's really none of your business. How much? Eight septims per day, plus lodging. See, now, that wasn't so hard. Excuse me, I have other things to attend to. <laughs> awesome. All right, well... Let's head back up. Then we'll go out the uh, yeah, wall side and we don't need to be there. Let's look for the uh I don't think we've been here yet, have we? This is why I love this mod. Look at that, the night sky. Gorgeous. Alright, Riften. Iverstead's this way. Oh, okay. So there's a few things that we can discover. A camp that, for whatever reason, sometimes crashes on me. I don't know why. It's the lumberjacks camp. Oh, and uh, dead lumberjack.
I am curious to see how iris it looks. I, I don't know if I uh, actually got to really check this out during the daytime yet. I only did minimalistic testing here, so... Yeah, there's that. Um, so Villamere is going to be here. So let's take a look. Uh, yeah, this looks this looks right. Yeah, way better than uh, having some area edits in here that mess with things. Yeah, that looks proper. Okay. Let's turn our our vampire vision on so you guys can see. See the blinding river. All right, we have no business with Narfi. Spellstar Farm. On your way up the 7,000 steps again, Klimek? Not today. I'm just not ready to make the climb to High Hrothgar. The path isn't safe. I like his outfit. Aren't the gray beards expecting some supplies? That tunic looks pretty Honestly, nice. Honestly, I'm not certain. His too. to be allowed into the monastery. Perhaps one day. Those bears are making Miss Temba so angry. Bears, I hope huh? you can do something about them. Me? I don't know about that. Oh. Uh, dead and dead. That would be the bears, probably, huh? one all right you boys ready let's take a aim to the 7,000 steps time of day we got a little bit of time ah there's an altar repair and the townspeople are pissed. Great. I thought I was far enough away. Here, have a troll. Oh, he landed in the water. Oh, he died. Okay. Well, I think we have a little bit of a bounty now in the rift. Oh, well. Well, the Barknar doesn't really seem, uh... Too worried about us. Good luck surviving that. Yeah, I didn't think so. And yeah, we got a perk. So let's get the, uh, well, Yeah, let's get the gargoyle while we can. And then we'll go right side, sort of up the center, then over to the left. And then we'll take Royal Bloodline. So, summon gargoyle. And let me save here. Um, we're goats. Because that's all we need on the path up here is, is more of these blasted things. It's up here.
that is kind of I don't know they're both kind of blinding yeah let's just stick with the regular no vision for right now Oh, did I pass the fourth one? All right, you know what? I don't care. Just want to go talk to the Greybeards. That's all I want to do. And uh, get over here. Oh, he's dead. Okay. Well, since we missed it, no sense in getting it on the way back either. Although that predator vision does kind of make it look like it's nice and uh, you get that nice mist on the ground, so. So, uh, we need unrelenting force. We haven't been here yet. In 29 levels, we have not been to High Rothgar. So let me just make sure everything I have is equipped when I turn back. Yes, 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 yes. Mm hmm mm hmm yeah. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And, uh, yeah, we're good. So let's head inside. I sense very powerful blood nearby, huh? This is good to know. So, a dragonborn appears at this moment in the turning of the age. It would seem so. Uh, you call me dragonborn. Does this mean? First, let us I'm an elf. Truly are dragonborn. Let us taste of your voice. So you too don't believe me, huh? All right. Do not be afraid. Your shot. Wait. All right. Yeah. Just double checking. I mean, it looked like it harmed you a little bit. It is you. Welcome to High Hrothgar. I am Master Angir. I speak for the Greybeards. Now, tell me, Dragonborn, why have you come here? Well, I'm answering your summons, obviously. We are honored to welcome a Dragonborn to High Hrothgar. We will do our best to teach you how to use your gift in fulfillment of your destiny. My destiny? What do you mean, my destiny? That is for you to discover. Ah. We can show you the way. But not your destination. Sounds like a song. So, alright. Who exactly are you and what is this place that I'm standing in? We are the Greybeards. Followers of the Way of the Voice. You stand in High Hrothgar. On the slopes of Kinarith's sacred mountain. Here we commune with the voice of the sky. And strive to achieve balance between our inner and outer selves. All right, well then I guess I'm ready to learn if you're going to teach me something. Hopefully it's useful. You have shown that you are dragonborn. You have the inborn gift. But do you have the discipline and temperament to follow the path laid out for you? Uh, that remains to be seen. Without training, you have already taken the first steps towards... So as you can tell, it's, uh... Into a you know, just a standard 
Seen it higher up. I don't have JKs. So I don't think I do anyway. When you shout, you speak check. in the language of dragons. Yeah, Thus no, I don't have it. <laughs> gives you an inborn ability to learn Just uh, some textures power. and things like that. This uh, all shouts are made up. This of is uh, again is Skyland. So as you master each word, your shout will become progressively stronger. The kill looks really good. Master Einarth will now teach you grow, the second word in unrelenting force. Grow means balance in the dragon tongue. Oh, that was interesting. Combine so the light was from the storm, force flickering down. To focus your thumb that was pretty shot. cool. Grow. Nice. What do you What do you want me to do with that? Is it like the walls? I have to get close to it. Ah. Apparently that's the case. You word like a master. You truly do have the gift. Yes. But learning a word of power is only the first step. You must unlock its meaning with constant practice in order to use it in a shout. Well, that is how the rest of us learn shouts. As Dragonborn, you can absorb a slain dragon's life force and knowledge directly. As part of your initiation, Master Einarth will allow you to tap into his understanding of rope. Now, let us see how quickly you can master your new thumb. Master my new thumb, huh? That's awesome. When the lightning comes down, shout to you can literally the see it on the, on the ground here. It's amazing. I like it. That's awesome. Well done. Again. You learn quickly. Once more. Impressive. Done, Your done, and done. Is precise. You show great promise, Dragonborn. We will perform your next trial in the courtyard. Follow Master Bori. Master Bori, which one? Uh, I'm assuming this is Bori. Yes. Oh, he doesn't say much, does he? Okay. Courtyard? Courtyard. Interesting. Where are my needs here? The air is bone chilling. We will now see how you learn a completely new shout. Master Bori will teach you wool, which means. Whirlwind. Whirlwind. Oh. Ah, another one, huh? You must hear the word within yourself before you can project it into a thumb. Approach Master Bori and he will gift you his knowledge of wool. One of the more useful shouts. Quickly, you can master a new Look, I mastered it. Master do we still have to do this? Will <laughs> whirlwind sprint. Then it will be your turn. Oh, fine. Let's obviously not pay attention. Sky Next. looks nice. Considering it's Whoop. after six. Now, your turn. My turn. Stand next to me. Master Bori will open the gate. Use your whirlwind sprint to pass through before it closes. Ah. Okay. Back to you. Ooh, sorry about that. Put a cloak on. It's beautiful up here. Look at this. Your quick mastery of a new thumb is uh, astonishing. 
I'd heard the stories of the abilities of Dragonborn, but to see it for myself. Well, isn't it this easy for everyone? No, indeed not. Oh. But beware that your skill does not outstrip your wisdom. You are now ready for your last trial. Last Retrieve trial. the horn of Jürgen Windcaller, our founder, from his tomb in the ancient fane of Ostengrau. Remain true to the way of the voice, and you will return. Okay. So let's see. We really don't care too much about them, nor do Jürgen Windcaller, I would say. He would be curious about these dragons. The dragons have been the only thing that have sort of been um, uh, even a moderate nuisance to him. So. so let's ask him why the dragons are returning, and if it has to do with me. No doubt the appearance of a dragon born at this time is not an accident. Your destiny is surely bound up with the return of the dragons. You should focus on honing your voice, and soon your path will be made clear. Hone my voice. All right. There's got to be more you can tell me, though. There is indeed much that we know that you do not. That does not mean that you are ready to understand it. <sighs> do not let your easy mastery of the voice tempt you into Talking the down arrogance to me like a of child. Power. That has been the downfall of many dragonborn before you. Okay. Well. Fair enough. Then guide you. You're gonna guide me, Wind? Is that is this how this works? Guide me right back inside because it's cold. Neither Rugil nor Magus like cold weather. So we're gonna get back inside and warm up a little bit. Oh, dinner time. What'd you make me? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Go enjoy. And uh, enjoy your lurk. Alright. Daytime. Let's uh, drop a save right here. So we could go back in Lord form, but um, let's just do this. We really didn't do anything in Iverstead, so there's no reason for us to... Uh, You know, we could plummet off the mountain. I, I, I've i done this before. We'll land right on White River. Well, not really. We'll land sort of down here. We haven't even uh, gone to the Guardian Stones yet. Yeah, we'll come out somewhere near Hunting Brew. I think I could do this. I don't have Drop Zone or anything like that, so if I die, I die. the hell? I don't even have Majestic Mountains in. That's crazy. Taking a page right out of the horse's playbook. There we go. Yep. And there you can see White Run. That's actually a pretty cool view. Easy to get down. I see a saber. Dead saber. Mm. 
Now, I was gonna make something and I needed pelts, and I forget what it was for. Between the saber cat and the bear, I think we're fine. Let's get uh, long stride. I don't think we could pray. I think it's got to be nighttime. Oh, did I just bug out? I did because I tried to. Well, here, let's do this. Let's see if Vampire Lord kicks me out of it. Uh oh. Yeah, it's gonna turn me back. Shit. That guard saw me all the way down here. I think. Now let's use Whirlwind Sprint to get across. Oh, he wasn't dead. Okay, well he's dead now. Let's see, who saw me? Was it the mud crab or the guard? Doesn't seem to be the guard. Looking to do some hunting? Oh, we're good. Avoid Brittle Shin Pass to Save. the southwest. Beautiful. So let's take a look at my skills. Restoration. Um, I think it's time we go see Farangar, and uh, we could do some training with Colette. Uh, but I believe, what do I have for healing? I just have basic healing, don't I? Oh, I've been using Divine Light. Hold on a second. Let's check FMR. It's under Paladin, right? Yeah, I've been using Divine Light. I don't have it favorited or anything like that, but... This will help. So we'll just make good use of all the uh, forgotten magic stuff. How about Warlock? Blade Curse is close. Uh, Void Bolt, not so much. Necrosis, uh, we're getting there. The Death Guard's almost going to hit five, which is great. And uh, Deathly Paul, no, we're still okay. Not a problem. Let's get uh, stride of Mr. Long on. How are my needs? Oh, did it fucking freeze because I tried to hit my need? Yeah, it did. Yep, it did. It sure did. Yeah, not responding. All right, I'll be in the task. Give me a sec. No log. Yeah, that was my fault. I was panning, and then I hit the uh, the needs mod. So, a little bit of a scripting issue. So, like I said, it hasn't been totally perfect i'm also not going to go for much longer i could see i'm already at the uh we're coming up on the two hour mark um and i'm also coming up on uh, about quarter to 9 p.m my time here for me so um i don't know maybe we get into uh the city a little bit this is the error that Wynn was talking it says there were errors compiling some effects check the log it's not really an issue if you go into reshade you get the display depth effects fails to compile which i believe is even said on the mods uh on the reshade page and the only other thing that i added to it um is the eye adaptation so
So yeah, we're right here. We're right back in White Run. Not a, not a problem. I was hoping the tea would would have warmed me up. I've been cold all day. I don't know why. Just been cold all day. It also could have been um combination of the shout. Um coming down the mountain. Plus, you know, I got these skeletons and everything, so the tomb. The tomb. So let's see. Let me stop. The air is cool. Alright, we'll go back into... Uh... Now, Darks is notorious for uh, having frame rate issues. I shouldn't be having any frame rate issues here. Um, let's check my stats. Uh, dip down to 40. So you can see, I, I've been at like... 200 FPS, but darks just hits. Plus the crows are right here. There's a lot going on in this area. Lux Via. Interesting NPCs is here. I mean, once they get in past the market, let's see. Yeah, we're back up to 60 frames. 59 and a half. Uh, so let's look on my map. Oh, the Khajiit Caravan's here. And we haven't discovered the White Run, uh, carriage stop either. That's fine. Resad. This one thinks you should be more careful with your spells. I'm always careful with my spells. Take a look. Alright, Rugal, what do we have for him? Dwarven arrows. Steel arrows. Uh, Amulet of Akatosh. Vermina. We'll always get another one of them. Okay. Uh, Deft Hands. Health we could actually get rid of. We have the health enchantment, so don't need this one anymore. Didn't break this down, but we'll do that. Um, oh, I wanted, to, I wanted the leather and the strips, and we need rolls of paper. I want to go to the sage crafting table. So let's do that. Uh, silver garnet ring. Sav. All right, wait, I want to keep that. Can you buy this one for three ninety? Beautiful. How about books that I have extras of? Phantom shroud. I can have that. Don't need that. Um, and the journals butchers we don't need. Let's get them down. Some amethysts. Okay, I think we're good. Yeah, we're good. Okay. May your road lead you to warm sands. Warm sands, yes. Let's head inside White Run. What time is it? 8.30 in the a.m. So that's perfect. Eight ball. Now you're now you're talking like it's a carn stream there. The eight ball there. I do like Karn's eight ball on a stream though, it is fun. Ugh. We're inching, we're ever ever closer to that magical number of three zero. There we go. I absolutely love the way that my white run looks. Look at this. 
Can't believe that one mod is handling the textures for this. Really got to give credit to John Rose, the author of Skyland. And all the Skyland mods, obviously. He, he's done a fantastic job, uh, you know, making sure everything stays current. I mean, I have other mods in here for, for Whiterun, obviously. But with no EMB, with just a reshade, and, I mean, we're just shy of 60 frames. So, not too bad. Adrian, I, I do need to Got use the uh, tanning rack here. More inside. What do we need? We need leathers. And more leathers. Leathers. And, um... We'll get three strips here. Alright. What do I need now? I need uh, rolls of paper. Which, ironically enough, I think we can get from Farangar. We could steal some. Let's get some Tundra Cotton as well. We haven't used our Ashlander, our, our I should say our vampiric oh, Ashlander sold, tent. What brings you to the market? I'm here to buy food, Nazim. I suppose you don't need to worry about that. Owning a farm does have its advantages. Once I've made enough money trading with the I don't think we've talked to you as old yet, have we? The mare from no, we haven't. Yeah, I don't have any of the fancy stuff. <laughs> As something I have to add in. Like I said, I've just been lazy about it. Before my ma and da passed, I told them that one day I'd be I don't know, it's weird. It's like everybody's got them. I met one of the caravans stuff like that on their streams. He said he'd help me get started if I could bring And it would definitely place. distract me. Easier said than done. So maybe I'll do it, I don't know. You do that? I can get rid of this mammoth tusk I've been carrying them, around since like level 3. Help you get a fair bargain in the future? I happen to have one on me. Here you go. Thank you. Nimits aren't that hard to you bring down. That old you could tell, uh, Maybe you could I'll tell Madron that. Maybe I'll be able to become a caravaner myself one day. Got to take off for a bit. We'll check, Let but yeah, you a thing not a problem, bud. Bargaining. We'll see you later. Want some shifty merchant giving you a raw trade. Is that our level? I'll never forget you. Oh, damn, so close. Close yet far. Mr. Can you spare a coin? Oh, thank you. Divines, bless your kind heart. May we truly reach ah, little potatoes. <sighs> Gotta love them. We are but Riding in the field. So we'll go to the sage crafting table. Um... I'm not sure I need anything else. There is a tome I absolutely want. Um, and I forgot to pick one up. There's one in the Arcanium. And uh, there's one sort of nearby, but not really. So uh, if I have rolls of paper on me, I can craft it now. So let's see what I can make. Unenchanted. All right, so we can start making expert stuff. Expert illusion back left. We need a greater soul gem. I actually have the rolls of paper on me. I have five. Um, and then for back right. Journeyman, huh? Maybe journeyman destruction back right. Not like I need my destruction spells to be more powerful. Uh, what do we have? Well, let's just get the illusion one out of the way, right? Expert illusion is going to be back right. All right, so we need we need a greater soldier. I'm not going to go purchase one. Oh. For some weird reason, I thought. Okay, never mind. And let's break down the. Uh, Necklace of Deft Hands, Ring of Rebuking, and this silver ring will get weird, because I have greater gems.
Fangar. Your skin's as pale as the snow. You think? Scared of sunlight or something? No, no, no. Uh, I need to purchase something from you. So you wish to master the arcane arts? I hope you have it. There's a greater. We're gonna buy one of each. We're gonna buy an unenchanted and an enchanted, just because I don't know. And then you can have the silver ring. Make some money back. Okay. Remember. So let's see. Just to make sure. So we're going from Apprentice Illusion back left. And the Journeyman Restoration is back right. So we want back left for Illusion. Your mind is the best me, weapon you best have. It is. So where is it? it takes a while to make a dress, Dagny. You yes, it does. Dagny. Alright. Expert Illusion back left. So we're going from 20 to 40% as if my illusions needed it. Now, how to craft Sage Crafting Table? There is a way. I should probably read the book. Which I have on me. So let's swap these out. Um, so yeah, 20% to Expert. And then I can sell this one. So now, let's look at my illusions. Calm is level 50 single cast. Frenzy is 59. Muffle is 417. I might just be so a what's a dual cast? Wow, we're almost 20 minutes with a dual cast muffle. That's that's what I was talking about. Um, so with the uh, equipable tomes mod, uh, I was able to get muffle. I think up to around 1,400 something seconds for a dual cast, like it shows right there, which is I think I don't know. It's close to a half hour's worth of muffled uh, muffled movement. It's pretty crazy. Don't think for a moment I don't take my duties as seriously as the Yar himself. Well, I hope so. Alright. Well, let's take the level up. Uh, magic is 609. I'm going to pop this one into health. And that may be my last one in health for a while. Three perks. Let's look at enchanting. We don't need weapon enchanter. Um, regalia. I mean, this is, you know, sort of just icing on the cake. We'll hold on to the perks. Yeah, sneak's not even a 50. Although, sneak attacks, what's this? Deadly aim, assassin's blade, silent movement. Alright, what's this one? Light foot, don't need that. Blind spot, 30% harder. So, this is the next one, is 50. Okay, so blind spot, fog of war. Alright, so these are normal stuff that I would have seen in Ordinator. And, uh, let's head outside. And,. In each of us, the future of Skyrim, the future of Damriel, and there it is. Storm cloaks, Imperials, dragons. Oh, did you see that? Look at that. Let them come. Into the void we go. 
Is that on this side too? Yeah, it is. I must have a patch in the wrong spot. Okay. I'd never come up that way, which is why I uh, Thinking of settling never in. noticed it. Okay. Avoid the void. What's up, Joe? How's it going? All fled. Goods and wares of all kinds, and all kinds there are the crows. I could have sworn um, we've discovered this carriage stop. Have we really not been? Oh no, because I. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. We're, we have the Horn of Jurgen Windcaller. Let's look here. But we haven't... Oh, because of Skyrim Unbound. We haven't gone through Bleak Falls. We haven't discovered the uh, Western Watchtower, which I can see from here. Now, I thought there was a, uh, oh, shit. Was it a worthy opponent? But we the occultist. Yeah, but we is proving. I, I have no intention of doing that. Nope, nope, and lots of nope. There's White Run. There we go, all three of my death guards with me. Okay. He kind of came out of nowhere. I probably should have been expecting it, but. It's fine. Destroyed house. some money Is that one or is that a dummy? I can't tell. Oh, there we go. They're gonna fight each other. How many are there?
There you go, boys. Go get him. I need to feed. I was going to say, I hope that doesn't... Uh... Oh, Joe, much appreciated, buddy. Throwing 100 biddies my way. Just because. <laughs> much appreciated. I don't know if my alert went off. I didn't hear anything. I would prefer if you didn't stab me in the back. Let's see. Do I have heal undead? All you got. No, but they're going to wreck you. hear more of them. I just don't know where they're at. I know there's one up there somewhere. Let's see if we could aggro him and bring him down. Come on. That doesn't go far enough. You know what? I don't care. Let's uh, let's just get out of here. What do we got? Another afflicted? They wear the dumbest stuff. Huh? No more. I yield. I yield. I'm now a blooded vampire, apparently. Who would have guessed? So let's see. Skills and spells. I have nine. I just haven't been putting them in anything. Uh, we can now take... Um, get, I, I'm, no, I'm not going to use this because this is going to become moot very soon. Yeah, we really just needed seduction. That's all we needed. I guess I can invoke fog, but I don't know. It seems kind of pointless to me. Ah, so with that, there's the vigil. That's what we're looking for. We're going to move that there. Um... Let me just make an official save 151. Yeah, a little over two hours, guys. It's after nine for me. Like I said, I was going to do a really short one today. Keep it on the uh, on the easier side. We hit 30. We're going to be coming back, hopefully tomorrow. We're going to get right into In Their Footsteps. Um, so let's see. Who is doing what? I know Michael is working on, I think, his his new loot video. Let's just check and see. Yeah, loot tutorial work. So he's working on a tutorial for loot. I know this is something that a lot of people were uh, curious about. I think we're going to go raid him. Let's get the command going in. Uh, big thanks to everybody today. Um, you guys have been awesomely generous, and it's greatly appreciated right now. Um, I was gonna take today off, and I'm I'm really glad I didn't. I know it's 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 on the shorter side. You know, we're about two hours and twenty minutes, give or take. Um, but yeah, definitely appreciate. It. So you know, for the just the cheers today, you guys are awesome. Um. I have some things planned for, uh, I'm working on an, like a side build. I have, I have a copied profile 
uh, with Percus Maximus. And I was like I was mentioning earlier on, I was also kind of messing around with it on uh, Ellie, just to see some of the differences in um, like the PCAP patcher and everything like that, um, among other things. Uh, the Ellie game, like I said, I never got to mod it on PC, so I started right with Special Edition. Some people say Ellie's easier. I say Special Edition's way easier. And, of course, I'm right. So, um, <laughs> it's just that I haven't done it as much. Um, but I had a, had a pretty good-looking game. It's just it's weird on that 32-bit uh, Skyrim game. I'm not used to it. I'm really used to the 64-bit. So, anyway, uh, let's... Jeez, I didn't even put the command in. There. We'll go raid. Uh, we'll go raid Michael. Show him some love. You guys are pretty much all familiar with gamer poets. Um, I'll be back tomorrow at some point. A lot earlier. Um, definitely not this late. Like I said, I was screwing around. So, but we'll go show him some love, and uh, I will see you all soon. Everybody, enjoy your night. Peace. Okay. We're under attack. Jesus, it's the night low raids. <laughs> Man the towers, we don't have any. Grab the whips, it's all we have. Magus, how are you, buddy? Sue me. Thanks for shouting Magus out. Guard your pants yet kneels after him. You don't bother, Sue me. You don't bother at all. Magus, welcome in. Magus, Magus, do you know how to change the color of the UI? Sue me would like to know. Welcome in, Magus. Welcome in, Raiders. I literally just finished everything I can do tonight <laughs> on this video. The instructional part. All the instructional footage of this Tuesday's video is complete. The Loot Basics video. <clears throat> Magus, everybody. I have to imagine you folks know him. If not, check him out. <clears throat> He's one of the reasons I am streaming here on Twitch in the first place. He is one of a couple of people who convinced me to say screw it and give it a try, and I'm happy he did. <clears throat> Doing Skyrim. <clears throat> no, not from Loot, Magus. Not from Loot. God dang it. <clears throat> Sumi is trying to edit files. <laughs> Raided by coconuts. We had another raid earlier too. Who the heck raided me earlier? My brain. A few raids today. <clears throat> Sumi, did you raid me or did you just pop in? When Erica the cat is here. I don't know if she raided me or just popped in either. We've had a few raids raids today. <clears throat> file settings theme dark is the options there no no not loot not loot damn it magus some kind of ui <clears throat> erica rated today okay all right erica sumi magus p3 coconuts appreciate you folks man so yeah, I just finished up my freaking loot video. We're going to give it a watch. <laughs> Not the video, this part. I have to record the live footage, which I can't do till tomorrow. <laughs> and um, that's all I have left to do. <clears throat> record the live footage, edit it, <clears throat> and then stick it all together. Dialogue and stuff. It's, it's, it's text you see on screen in-game when you're, when you're playing Skyrim. to make sure master files load before plugins that require them, that master files are present where needed, and if there are any known incompatibilities in your load order. <laughs> Magus, have you heard my voicemail box? I like showing off my new toys to all my friends. I can't remember who's been here, though. <clears throat> Mind, I had 10 drop out of the rim world. <laughs> Only people. Thank you for your comment. While I'm like, what's up, the god? Michael is not taking criticism at this time. Please leave your message after the tone. Welcome to Michael's voicemail box. <laughs> <laughs> I'm off now. I'll try to be a pain in the ass tomorrow. I'm, I'm sure off you now. will try succeed. to be a pain in the ass tomorrow. I'm I do. sure you will succeed. Take it easy, buddy. Take yeah, it easy. easy. Take it easy, <clears throat> buddy. Take it easy. <clears throat> <clears throat> 
Good guy, man. I appreciate that. P3. Good guy, man. I appreciate that. I love RimWorld. I love RimWorld. I love RimWorld. And I love RimWorld people. I love RimWorld. And I love RimWorld people. You didn't hear it either, T3? I made the You didn't hear it either, T3? I the wind, what the hell? The wind, what the hell? The wind come with Magus. The wind's one of the other, one of the other people who talked me into streaming on Twitch. Another fantastical Skyrim streamer. Okay, who are you and what have you done with Magus? I've I've taken his pants and I've stuffed them in the hole behind my studio. <clears throat> Who's wearing the pants now? Magus. Magus is not. All that loot requires is one game to be installed that it works with, and that the game was launched at least one time since its installation, so it can be detected. The void hole. One installation of loot is all you need for all of your games. Indeed. Open the loot website. Download. Download loot. Come on. You are brought to the most recent release. Scroll <laughs> down to assets. Download the loot executable. 32-bit for 32-bit systems. Fuck is task bit. three? Where are you? Three? Six hours ahead? Oh, you're like, um... Germany? Maybe... Switzerland area? I'm going with Germany. I'm going with Germany. Sumi, go to bed! For 64-bit systems. Run the executable. I'm not also be if you get this window, they went the way of the highway info, as soon as the stream It's all right, buddy. It's okay. Select your language. Browse and choose a location. That's cheetah where I am now. And to install loot too. It can be placed anywhere other than program files. I put mine with my modding tools. Once the location is selected, comp complete the prompts. Loot will auto launch. Just close it. That one is done as well. Mother